What's up, my beautiful nieces? Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine. If you up in here, welcome to a karmic circus where we expose all of these karmic ass clowns. Now, collective, I didn't have nothing to read about. So I opened up my Bible that I wrote. And all it is is a bunch of channel messages that um, I got. And I ain't did a bunch of readings on this messages that I get. So sometimes I just open this up just like I would with the regular Bible and see what the message is. What is it that the most high God want me to talk to? This shirt make it look like my, my titties is off balance or something. Make it look like one of my titties bigger than the other. It ain't. They both the same. <laughs> That's the way this shirt is made. Okay. But anyway, um, is somebody out there, particularly a divine masculine, getting advice from a secret hater? So I started pulling cards. Okay, let me see the cards. And <laughs> the first card that came out, he don't want to hear nothing, whoever this person is. He don't want to hear it. He's closing his eyes to the shit. I don't want to hear it. Whatever advice they gave him, it was some bad advice. Bad advice. He don't want to hear it. And he's disappointed. He's dissatisfied. <laughs> he's upset. And he don't want to hear that shit. He's, he's tuning this person out. And whoever this person is, they got a devil energy. They got a spiritual assassin. Death magic. watching and we have open relationship and I stopped pulling so what 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 I get is they got advice from somebody that's either hating on them hating on you or hating on your relationship somebody wants something to come to an end now for some of you you may not be in a relationship with nobody but you could have an ex of yours confirmation you can have an ex of yours that's out there trying to get advice on you. This could be somebody you done broke up from. For some of you, this is somebody you could be currently with. And somebody gave them some bad advice, basically. Now they don't want to listen to this person. They tuning them out and see whoever this person is. They are a spiritual assassin. So they were sent into your person's life or to your life to cause havoc, distress, to kill your energy, kill your essence, kill your characteristics, kill everything about you. They want to spiritually assassinate you, assassinate you. And somebody is watching. I don't know if this this is your person watching you 
or somebody watching your person. And it's 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 an open relationship out here. So this masculine is getting advice from somebody he's in a an open relationship. This is why some of you divine feminines and masculines, when you're in a relationship with people that's dealing with their exes and stuff, getting advice from their ex. That ex is automatically going to give them some fucked up advice because it didn't work out with them and they didn't want them in the first place. But, you know, it's like they'll act like they care about them when they really don't. And they don't care about them. Why are they not together? Why is the relationship open? You know what I mean? If, if, if they were in an open relationship, that means that somebody wasn't satisfied with one person. Somebody would rather have five other people. And I always say five. Because they're looking for a divine masculine or a divine feminine. But they're looking for them in five different people. Instead of looking for that one divine masculine or that one divine feminine. That carries all the characteristics of the kings and the queens. So they turn themselves into hoes, manipulators, confirmation for somebody. And with this being, this this is an attachment to this masculine, somebody he's in an open relationship with, somebody he feels comfortable talking to them about a divine feminine. So we're going we to... Um, Get some energy of this person. They were there. This person watches you, Divine Feminine. This could be a Queen of Wands energy or a Queen of Pentacles. A Queen of Pentacles in reverse out here. This is somebody who's money hungry. She's stingy. She hoards money. Uh, she recklessly spends her money. She may have her own business or be an entrepreneur or something. And I see the energy of, of the, the Queen of Wands. So you could be the Queen of Wands, Divine Feminine. and um, Or you could be the Queen of Pentacles. That's not the, the low vibrational. You just may not be talking to your person. But right about now, this masculine, he's, he's, you know, disappointed. Whoever the person he, who he's getting advice from, yeah, the, who he's getting, you're not this queen of pentacles, divine feminine, not this one in reverse. Yeah, whoever this queen of pentacles is, she's unrealistic. She has an overactive imagination. So she made up a lot of lies and a lot of things that she told this masculine. And he don't want to hear it. <laughs> he don't want to hear nothing she got to say. So tell me about this Queen of Pentacles and this reverse and this masculine. Why he don't want to listen? Why is he disappointed? Why is he tuning her out? She's saying, you know, with the, the page of swords in reverse, air sign energy. She's saying that, like, Divine Feminine, if if you're curious about awakening, you're curious about confirmation, if you're curious about spirituality and, you know, coming to new, new beginnings and all of this stuff, this karmic energy, whoever she is, she don't want to know shit. She don't want to learn shit. And she don't want this masculine to see that you do. She wants things to come to an end. So she's been doing some sort of death match because she's jealous. She 
believes the spiritual assassin that was sent into this masculine's life, or this masculine can be a spiritual assassin that was sent into your life. Take it where it resonates. It's different for everybody. Somebody is watching. But the, the overall energy, what I mainly see, this masculine, this is a masculine energy. He don't, he don't want to hear it. Whatever she told him distressed him out, have him upset, uncomfortable. He's uneasy. He don't want to hear no more. So we need to see what, what she's what she's saying to him. if this is resonating with you <coughs> to hit that thumbs up so this masculine is getting advice from a secret hater holy spirit he don't trust her no more yeah he don't trust her He don't want to hear whatever she's saying. He don't trust her. At one time, he possibly may have adored whoever this person is. Confirmation. But now he don't trust her. She's a spiritual assassin. And, and she basically came to sabotage this masculine um, from being with his divine feminine. Now she's sick because the dark energy that she sent towards you, Divine Feminine, is going back to her. She may be saying something, trying to, you know, tell this masculine that she's sick because of something that Divine Feminine sent to her. But see, now these masculines are awakening. And he know that she's sick because she was the one doing some shit and they returned the center. Yeah. The golden apple. Competition. Psychic. Harmful to women. So this is this is a a, a karmic energy. She puts herself in competition with women and she do some sort of something she does and some sort of magic that's harmful to women, okay? That's because she's always in competition with somebody. psychic out here side chick I heard psychic side chick he don't want to hear it he didn't block this karmic Possibly because she she tried to blame Divine Feminine for her getting, you know, karma some. She trying to say Divine Feminine. So he didn't block her. She tried to send some energy to a Divine Feminine to say that, I mean, to make Divine Feminine sick. But the energy went back to her. And she's telling this masculine confirmation. She's telling this masculine that you did something to her. So he blocked her because he know that you got a beautiful spirit. 
yeah, he know. He know you divine feminine, and he know that you wouldn't do this. Yeah. And he know that this person is a nasty beast. Yeah, so he blocked her. He don't want to hear nothing she got to say. Nothing. He knows she was there to assassinate his character and yours, Divine Feminine. He knows that she she wanted things to come to an end or she wanted to break the relationship up. And if he was in an open relationship with her, that shit is closed now. State of a goddess. Wow. Jealous. See, for some of you, this this may be this this karmic energy keep coming up as a karmic feminine that this masculine was dealing with, and they had an open relationship. She could live in a whole another city or another state, and no matter who this masculine messed around with, he would always go back and forth. He never let this karmic go. And it's like, with her being a spiritual assassin, every feminine energy that this masculine comes in contact with, this karmic feminine ex, or whoever she is, who he's in an open relationship with, she downplays any feminine energy to this masculine. She, she, she. You know, she says a lot of negative things about any other woman that comes in this masculine's life. She want to be the cream of the crop in this masculine's life, even though they're not together. She want him to look up to her. Now he don't want to hear shit she got to say. I don't want to hear it. Confirmation for somebody. This karmic is is um, for everybody. Okay, she sleeps around, and this is why she says negative things about a divine feminine because she's jealous. Divine feminine is psychic. Mm -hmm. She takes care of herself. She loves herself. She's nurturing and loving and giving towards other people, and this karmic energy is nothing like that. She's out there sleeping around. Free for all and asleep with your man, she get the change. If your man is weak, this karmic will sleep with him. Okay. Now this is nobody's energy I, that I know. I'm just reading cards, okay? Because some of the comments I delete them that people put in the comments. I'm not talking to you. Did you did you pay for uh, a personal read? No, you didn't. So this is not your read. This is a karmic, this is a masculine who's, um, now if it resonates with you, that's a different story. This is about a, a masculine that is dealing with a karmic feminine. He done blocked her because he, she's been giving him some bad advice. Okay, and this is somebody he's in an open relationship. Some divine feminines may not even be aware of this. Yeah, a private relationship. This is somebody he was in a private relationship with. That's promiscuous. But see, he ain't he ain't he ain't caught her. He ain't caught her yet. Cause she putting on a show. She's making him believe that it's only him and her. But see, he why why don't he want to hear nothing this partner got to say? Why is he tuning her out? Wow. See? Thank you, Holy Spirit. Because cause she sleeps around. And she done made up all of these lies about divine feminine. Why is this masculine tuning this karmic girl?
So she's she's sleeping around. She's doing drugs. Why is this bank failure? He's losing money with her. Dealing with her. So he didn't block her. She doing drugs and sleeping around. He like hell no. Nah. He pissed off. So he done blocked her. He knows she was here to assassinate his character or to assassinate Divine Feminist's character. He know this now. And he done blocked her. Yup. He knows that she wants things to come to an end for him. And she's sleeping around and doing drugs. That's so many toxic vibrations and energies around this, this feminine, whoever she is. For one, if she's sleeping around, everybody she's sleeping around with, she picking up their energy. Two, if she doing drugs, them drugs is, is giving her a spirit to do things that she shouldn't do. Which will make her do things like sell her body, she'll suck a dick for these drugs. Yeah. This is this she's a prostitute. She's a hoe. This is a drug hoe. She ain't even getting paid for sleeping around. She's The way she's getting paid is through drugs. She has some sort of pill addiction. Yeah. Or she may, she may be promiscuous, popping pills, ecstasy pills and shit. So, Holy Spirit, tell me more about this person who's giving this masculine this advice. Tell me about the person who's giving this masculine advice. success abundance it's about you being in the energy of where people are drawn to you the sun gives you good energy you hear how they say when when you're feeling down to go and go and sit out in the sun go get some sunlight when your house feels you may be sitting in your house and you have all of your windows and shit closed. Open them windows. Open them blinds up. Let the sun shine in. Okay. You 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 may need to open them blinds sometime and see some things. You may be looking for something. I don't know. Something you may can't see because you ain't opened your blinds or you ain't pulled back them curtains and you ain't let them let let all of that dark energy go. The only reason I have mine like this is because I'm recording. But I, I love opening my blinds. I love looking out the window and seeing the little cute birds and stuff. Yeah, I like that. It's healing, okay, to see nature. Ace of Pentacles. That's all about moving forward. The Hermit. Virgo Energy. Ace of Pentacles, Virgo energy, and the sun. We got Capricorn out here with the devil. This masculine, yeah, he didn't he didn't ghost at her. He don't want to hear nothing she got to say. She may even be trying to offer this masculine some money to try to make him happy. Or she could be happy um, getting dr drugs. Here's the, here's 
the ten of wands in reverse. This masculine is is he's he don't want to hear it. And the ten of wands that's in reverse. That's about um, being overburdened, you know, with things. He's not. Mm -mm. So this masculine. He may have found out that this karmic is doing drugs and he's been giving her money. Um, and she's been taking the money, buying drugs, pills with it. Now he losing money, so he didn't ghost her. He don't want to hear nothing. Yeah, she she, she could have drained his bank account. He pissed with this anger management outfit. So he had to get the fuck away from her. Yeah. Seven of Cups reverse. Be careful what you wish for. Overwhelmed by the choices that was made. Yeah, he's he's mad at the fact that he chose this karmic energy. She's doing drugs. She didn't either stole his money or drained his bank account. She out there sleeping around. Yeah. But she wants things to come to an end for a divine feminine. What happened between this masculine and this karmic feminine? Uh, I split the deck. Gossip. People could be gossiping about her. Or he could have received a message about her. Somebody told him. That she's either out there sleeping around, or she's doing drugs, or she's spending his money. <clears throat> he could have started watching her. He found out that she was fake. Yeah, she had somebody else in the cut. It's like see no evil, hear no evil. Type of energy. is this is his ex okay this is the ex so tell me more the spiritual assassin is his ex who he's in an open relationship he didn't ghost in her he don't want to hear shit she got to say He's overwhelmed by the choices that he made when, he, when it comes to her. He could have been traveling to this person. She may be traveling towards him. He don't want to hear it. Capricorn energy. Hermit energy. Virgo. Some sort of witchcraft or spell work is in reverse. Clarify the witchcraft. To fuck up his stability. His happy home. Again, it's the, the seven of cups. Overwhelmed by the choices that he made. Something may be significant to, um, May 11th, sudden wealth in reverse, because of this devil. She may be six years older than this masculine. I see a miscarriage here. Somebody could be doing time, somebody could be in jail, or somebody may want to waste time or spend time with you, something about the clock. Um, I see March 7th out here, January 2nd, June 5th. June 
sixth. A Queen of Cups energy, someone who's um, not caring, not loving. Yeah, Queen of Cups in reverse. So this, this karmic energy, she's a Queen of Cups reverse. And a Queen of Cups reverse is somebody who has no emotions. This is, see, this is where this masculine man, you need to stop getting advice from these women who, who they act like they didn't give a fuck about you in the relationship. Why all of a sudden they give a fuck now? They want to give you advice because they know you as a good catch or he knows that she knows that divine feminine is a good catch. So she's giving him all this bad advice to keep him from having a new beginning with somebody else and she's doing some sort of spell work. She's traveling to do some spell work. This person may wear her hair up in a like a loose ponytail. You know, um, how you put the ponytail and just kind of let it droop and droop around. That's how somebody wears their hair. Okay, an, uh, a loose ponytail. Wow, see? The upside down cross. That's why this, this masculine is ghosting her. She's doing witchcraft. The devil is out here. The upside down cross is out here. Manipulation is out, is out here. Queen of Cups in reverse. This is a female that don't give a fuck. And she's and she got many demons. She out here doing drugs. She's sleeping around. That's why she don't care. This is resonating with you. Hit that thumbs up button. If you're interested in a personal reading, all the information is in the description box below. And if you'd like to make a donation to my channel, all the information to my Cash App and PayPal is in the description box below. Pregnancy test. This masculine is ghosting her because he knows if she out here doing drugs, sleeping around, and then she want to try to tell him she pregnant, he like, hell no, nah, you ain't finna pin no shit on me. Yeah. Police may have been involved. This is trash bag Tracy. Yeah. He done kicked her to the curb and threw her in the trash. Uh, possibly she told him she was going she was pregnant or something. Um, but I do see a miscarriage out here. She had she was pregnant by this masculine, but she had a miscarriage because the most high God didn't want this masculine to have this baby with her. Because this woman is dark. So he knew that if, if she got pregnant by this masculine, that uh, she'll, you know, she'll be manipulating him, controlling him some sort of way, dogging him out, you know, talking bad about him, gossiping about him. She could be out here saying that she lost the baby because the masculine ghosted her. Luna, come here. Put that in the microwave for one minute. Well, not even one minute, just 30 seconds. relationship and he came out in reverse he found out yeah this is why he done left her she tried to blame her pregnancy on him and he knows she's out there sleeping around and she was in a private relationship with somebody else yeah so he threw her ass in the trash yeah he could have been you know somebody is traveling to do some sort of witchcraft to knock somebody's stability down to stop somebody you know, if she did all of, if, if, if this karmic, if she's this spiritual assassin and she's having a miscarriage 
she's losing her stability. So apparently this masculine, he was a big part of her stability. Now that he done ghosted her, that's not an over with. Yeah. Bad choice. And some of you, Divine Feminine, he could have, he, he, the bad choice was him. He could have threw you away. He could have kicked you to the curb and went into this private relationship with this karma. But see, the same thing, what's good for the goose is good for the gander. What he did to you is happening to him. Yeah. But the difference is, she, she got pregnant. And I hate to say it, it was it was a demon child, and that's why the most high took it. Didn't want it, want this masculine to have a baby with him. Yeah. It's hard. about you see she was trying to she was doing all of this stuff to for things to come to an end between this divine masculine and his divine feminine now if she tried to get pregnant by this masculine she had a miscarriage confirmation this masculine ghosted her because he probably saying that ain't my baby that ain't my baby you've been you've been fucking around Sleeping around, doing drugs and shit. Yep. And you was in a private relationship. You made me lose my money. I don't want to have. I don't want to hear shit. That's what he's saying. He don't want to hear it. He's overwhelmed by the emotions and the choices that he made. I'm going to stop this reading. I'll continue with another one. I'll see you guys in the next reading.